On Thursday, September 7th, Palazzo de Bacci in Orient Township kicked off the third annual ABC Open Championship Tournament. 250 players from the U.S. and Canada formed 60 teams in gold and silver divisions with gameplay taking place Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. The tournament was organized by the American Bocce Company out of Chicago. American Bocce Company is a organization dedicated to building the sport of bocce here in the country, giving it more opportunities, creating a, a national fervor and circuit for the sport. We've had the world championships here, we've had the U.S. championships here. This tournament brings on a different attitude. There's more energy for this type of tournament, uh, this type of program that we have now. Uh, you can feel the enthusiasm here. The enthusiasm is, is, is unbelievable, and that brings excitement, you know? It brings uh, a, a, you know, a lot of people to the facility as well, too. The teams competed over three days for medals and prize money with $5,000 going to the first place team in the gold division and $2,500 to the second place team. Oakland County was one of the tournament's proud sponsors. Uh, we are so excited. This is, brings great economic revenue to the area and all the hotels are full. Um, these are great contributors to our economy. We love the event. The, the, the management of this event, the owners of this facility are first rate. Yeah, I mean, I, I love this. I've been coming here since I was uh, a child to, to play, to go on dates. Um, I, the, the thing that I really love is this is such a novelty still. It's not basketball, it's not football. This and our curling rink down in the southern end of our county, I think, are really great assets uh, to provide a niche sport community, a, a glowing jewel, um, and, and a real attraction to come into our community. Yeah. As the tournament wound down on Saturday, Team Lutz Incorporated faced Highwood Bocce in the Gold Division Finals. Both teams are from the Chicago area and things got pretty intense. With the score 14-9, Team Glutes needed two points to claim the title. Here's how it played out. expected to be here. We made, we made runners up last year in this division and it was against a, the greatest, you know, yeah. one of the best players in the world. So we were geared towards winning this gold final and we made it back and did it. I heard you yell during one of your shots. I've been here before. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I get really amped up. I have a lot of emotions. So when somebody tests me, I'm going to come back and yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> Who made that final shot? <laughs> what was going through your head on that last shot? You had one point, needed two to yeah. win. What was going through your head? Get the next one and get out of here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He was tired, his back hurt. My back's been hurting all weekend. Uh, and I just wanted to do it for these guys, so that's it. What can you say about this beautiful venue and what was the tournament like? The tournament was very well run, super fun. It brings so many great people from all around the country. And um, I would say that it's, you know, lots of smiles, lots of good bocce ball, great competition. Um, and then, you know, everyone's hanging out and having fun afterwards too. And, but the facility is beautiful. We all love it. I love playing here. Um, and I can't wait to come back next year. Yeah. Organizers and players had nothing but praise for Palazzo de Bocce, which is open to the public when not hosting tournaments. Well, first and foremost was the facility. Um, this is one of the best bocce facilities in, in the world. Not just the country, not just the Midwest, but the entire world. Uh, ten courts uh, at competition size and this level of upkeep and maintenance is, is a rarity and allows us to do a lot with a tournament. So our best facility in Chicagoland has four courts and it's a wonderful club, Highwood Bocce Club, but it's four courts. You can do a lot more with ten. That's what brought us here and then once we started building a relationship with the Batavias um, and all the folks here, Jason and everyone that works here, um, we wanted to stay and, and keep building. All type of events here. Uh, you know, a lot of people, they pass by, we're a big building, and they think maybe private club, or uh, but we're open to the public for our regular dining. 
lunch, dining, we have leagues here, events, we do all kinds of events. You could have a 150 person event, you could have a 10 person event. We have all, we cater to all different types of groups here. And it's a great thing because uh, as you mentioned, you know, it's a lot of fun. It's an easy game to learn and it's fun to play. Plans are already underway for the fourth annual U.S. Open as well as the first International Open scheduled for May. For more information, you can call 248-371-9987 or visit palazzodebacci.com. In Orion Township, this is Joe Johnson reporting for ONTV News.